Hey everybody, welcome back. How's it doing? How's it sewing? You like that? How's it sewing? I'm Marcy of The Handmade Heralds and today I've got some quick tips on how to make your gathering life easier. So many of y'all hate gathering and you don't have to. Let's go. I know there are a lot of tips out there on uh, using yarn or using dental floss for your gathering needs. Y'all, don't go raiding the bathroom cabinet. Don't get ready to floss your teeth at night and find out there's no floss to be had because you used it up on a skirt. Use what you got. Use your thread. Here are the tips that you already know. You're going to sew at your longest stitch possible. You're going to leave nice long thread tails so that you can actually gather your fabric. But here's my first tip for you. Use one thread color for your needle and one thread color for your bobbin. My needle thread here is in white. My bobbin thread here is in black. Yes, I know. It takes like a full 60 seconds for you to change out the bobbin thread in your machine or change out the needle thread and there are so many things that you could have accomplished in that 60 seconds. My heart bleeds for you. Just change it. Now for these next tips, I'm going to need some assistance. Please welcome... Rob! <laughs> How about that for dramatic entrance? That was entrance? so good. <laughs> so swoopy. Swoopy. You know, definitely I want to be known as swoopy. Yeah, I think of you as swoopy. Thanks. We're going to be showing the folks some tips on gathering. Oh, gathering. Okay? And we're going to show them what to do and what maybe not to do. Why'd you motion over here with what not to do? Because you're the civilian and I'm the sewist. Now here you can see, Rob, we've got three lines of gathering stitches mm -hmm. versus two lines of gathering stitches. Mm -hmm. That because... That, that because... That because... That because... In the case of gathering stitches, more is more. More is more. Mm -hmm. More is more I, in a good way. I love that phrase. Rob is a more is more kind of person. More ketchup. More rows of gathering stitches means your gathers are going to be prettier. Not less. Not less. Rob, why don't you uh, handle your less half right here? Move these white threads out of the way. The needle threads and you're gonna be pulling. Is this the bobbin thread? It is the bobbin thread, Rob. You're gonna be pulling on the bobbin threads. Not just yet. Wait, are this, is there more than one? Yeah, there's more oh, than I one. See. You've got two rows. Oh, it was hidden. And we're gently gonna pull on those bobbin threads. Gently pull. There you go. You're doing so well. Okay, you can hold right there because you don't want to pull it all the way out. Now let's examine these two. Which gathers look better? Which look a little more uniform? Which look a little more floopy? Well, because I'm the civilian, I'm assuming this was the floopy. I mean, wouldn't you rather have this? I would. Why do that? I have this? You want a nice one? Yes. Okay, I'm going to get you a nice one. Okay. 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 Put this Ooh, I have three here. now. You do have three now. Look mm -hmm. at that. Okay, we both now have nice ones. Are you already getting your bobbin threads I, ready? Listen, I learned very quickly. Well, the problem is, Rob, you're not allowed to pull your bobbin threads for wow. this next tip. You're going to demonstrate pulling your needle thread for this next tip. Okay, so I'm assuming that's the white now? Mm-hmm, the needle thread is white and mm -hmm. the bobbin thread is black. Oh, it's how appropriate. And I just got that. Racial. <laughs> yes. Okay. And yes, it's a little bit of a hassle picking up the threads, but that's part of why you're choosing a contrasting color for your bobbin thread, okay? okay so I'm doing right. the same thing? Same thing. Okay, Let's see how the go. gathering goes. <laughs> oh wow, is it a little tough, Rob? It sounds a little tough. You said you were going to be a good one, a pretty one. Well, let's just stop right there. How did that feel gathering it that rock? It didn't feel good at all. You know why it didn't feel good at yeah, all? Yeah, because you had me do the bad thing. Because there's more tension on the needle thread than the bobbin thread. And that makes it easier to gather with the bobbin thread. Don't pull on the needle thread as the civilian here has done. Yeah, pull I on the bobbin thread. I did it because you told me to do it. It's okay, babe. It's now okay. I'm gonna have to go jump off a bridge because no, you told me to do that. No. Can I have a pretty one? You can have a pretty one. Let me just get you a pretty one. Just hold on a minute. 
here's a pretty one for each of us now. That doesn't look as pretty as yours. Well, let me just arrange it a little bit. Look. Okay, okay. great. Is that better? Yeah, that's good. Do you like that better? It's like a little skirt. Like. That's the point. That's the point of this, because I'm going to be making a gathered skirt. So uh -huh. I want to put these tips Reminds up me of that old Cha Charlie Chaplin. When he had the potatoes. Yep. <laughs> I'm full okay. idiot today. Okay, I've got some pins here. Mm -hmm. Are they only there? They're only there because oh. because only I'm gonna use these pins. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Okay. You over here, you're gonna knot your mm -hmm. threads together, right? All of them? All of them on both sides. What kind of knot? I call it a Girl Scout knot. You know, over and then under. Just knot them threads up. Okay. Just knot them I'm up. I'm sensing a theme here. Mm -hmm. Rob does the jank. Over on my side, I'm going to put a pin at the edge of my stitches. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. And I'm going to figure eight the thread. You'd think I could tie a knot, but I really yeah. can't. Yeah, you have to not talk while I'm telling the people what okay. I'm doing. All right. I'm going to figure eight the thread around the pin, and then I'm going to push the pin head all the way down to secure those stitches. Rob has a knot. He's going to knot the other side as well. Oh. And I'm gonna go over here, and I'm gonna put a pin in again, and figure eight those thread tails again. You have to get that knot real close to the fabric. Well, you didn't tell me that. Well, you just said tie a knot. Well, tie a knot as close to the fabric as possible. Oh, that's so good, babe. We got a knot here, that's here, so and good. here. Okay, that's great. Rob's knotted everything. I've got figure eights with a thread tail. Hmm. So right now, I could adjust my gathers if I wanted to. On Rob's piece, he can adjust his gathers if he wants to, but only so far. He's gonna have to stop at wherever he knotted his thread. Right here. He can't go any further. I could take my pin out if I wanted to, and I could, you know, redo those gathers if I wanted to, go back in and put my pin in. This is also easier when you're sewing. When it comes time to pull those gathering stitches out, I pull my pin out and then I've got three loose lines of stitching that mm -hmm. I'm gonna be able to pull out because sometimes you need to pull out. Rob is not gonna be able to pull out when he gets to the stitching. It's just not gonna work for him. He's gonna have a knot there. It's gonna be rough. It's gonna be tough. It's gonna be hard to pull out for Rob. I don't even know how it happens. It just happens. <laughs> I think we're all aware of how it happens, <laughs> aren't we folks? So proud of herself. <laughs> I win this round. That's three against one. Oh geez, Marcy, could I have a better one this time? You can, let me get you another one, babe. Just hold on a second there. Let me see what I have under my magical table. Okay, next tip. Let's pretend that we have sewn up our garment, mm -hmm. okay? And it's time to remove our gathering stitches. People hate this, Rob. People hate this. I they, kind of hate it right now. Oh, that's because you've been doing all the civilian steps. I'm mm, sorry. So genuine <laughs> with the apologies. <laughs> this isn't going to go well for you either. I'm sorry. I, shocker. I know. We're going to pretend. Hashtag. Shocked. So let's uh, remove our pins. Am I supposed to do this with yeah, you? Yeah, let's okay. remove our pins. So, do, 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 yeah, do. Oh, you're so good. Now, one by one. Mm -hmm. We're gonna remove these lines of stitches. Mm -hmm. I am going to pull one by one on the black thread tail, the bobbin okay. tail. Yep. And Rob is going to pull one by one on the needle tail. That's one down. All right now. How did that feel, babe? How did it yeah, feel it pulling? Felt, yeah, yeah, it felt kind of lovely. It, it was, did, it was, didn't it? Yeah, it was nice. It wasn't as hard? Mm -hmm. That's because pulling on the needle thread to remove your gathering stitches is actually the winner. Rob wins this round. Right! Winner, winner, <gasps> chicken dinner. Okay, okay. Well, those are our tips for gathering, folks. We want to thank our civilian guest for really, really. Yeah, here's my tip. Don't be the civilian guest for Marcy. <laughs> <laughs> you look like a fool. I hope
hope that you try some gathering with thread. Don't be going into the bathroom cabinet and, and pilferating the dental floss. Pilferating? That's right, pilferating. Whoa. Is that a word? No, pilfering. Pilfering. Don't go pilfering the dental floss. Pilferating is kind of fun, though. I like pilferating. It's one higher than pilfering. It's one more. That's right. Pilferating. It's it's a level up from mm -hmm. pilfering. It goes to 11. <laughs> pilferating. That's it for this week, folks. It's been a pleasure being the butt of this joke. Peace out, folks. Emphasis on peace. Should we can't get out? Sure.